one click and it was all over. And there were several of those clicks as the UNHCS clinic, UNHCC, hosted another COVID vaccine drive to immunize both the local and international community. Yeah. This vaccine drive is not the clinic's first, and it saw almost 150 people show up to get their first, second, or booster shot. Something that greatly pleased one of the nurses. All the people we gave them for the first dose, they are here. Mm -hmm. And even for the first dose, they came. Mm -hmm. And the same thing for the booster also, they came here. Sure. So we are satisfied. Currently, there are no cases of Omicron being reported in Ethiopia. However, for some like Gail, Taking the booster shot is still a way of protecting themselves and their loved ones rather than taking unnecessary risks. I think from what I read that uh, by mixing and matching you mm -hmm. might get a little bit stronger immunity. Sure. So I thought it would be a good idea. With three different vaccines available, the AstraZeneca, Johnson & Johnson and Pfizer, the choice of which one was administered to each person varied depending on a couple of factors. First thing for those who took uh, AstraZeneca, mm -hmm. we repeat, the, we give the second dose. Mm -hmm. Those who came for booster, we prefer to give the Pfizer. Mm -hmm. And for the first, who came for the first time, we give the choice to choose the patient and mm -hmm. tell them. Most of the people, they choose J and J because it's a single dose. Mm -hmm. Despite calls for a booster dose being in early stages of research, that did not deter this vaccine taker from getting his Pfizer booster. It, for me, better to be safe. Uh, I don't know whether it works because that is still to be found out. Uh, the, uh, uh, there are quite a number of mutations in that Omicron and maybe maybe many of the vaccines need to be adjusted. Mm -hmm. But at least it will give some protection at least. So. And while the Ethiopian government has done its part in vaccinating the masses, having the UN help out has increased vaccine accessibility. In the beginning, of course, it was challenging, but thanks to the UN program uh, allowing us to uh, partners to take part, uh, we, we've been able to access and I've been able to get all of my shots on time. Asked whether there would be another vaccination drive soon, the answer was pretty stern. Yes, yes, we, because we gave already first dose, now we start, we repeat the second dose, this is a must. Loic Youth, KMSS.